Hi folks, it's John from LastChanceAutoStore.com. I'd like to share with you a brief update. This is the 05 Honda Element that we were talking about um, doing this textured or the bed liner exterior. Um, and it's going to be obviously the two-tone. So um, we, I've got some pictures um, where we were doing the bodywork uh, before. But rather than bore you with that, I think we'll just walk around quickly. So um, basically what we've done is we're going to be... You can see here where the whole top half is, we're going to call it Last Chance Green. It's very similar to Kawasaki Green. Um, so the, the guys and gals did all of the, uh, the bodywork on it. You can see here, uh, there's some evidence, there's some, a few door dings uh, down here. There was a crease that somebody, uh, they put a dent and a crease in the back door in a parking lot. So uh, something that we had mentioned in earlier videos, whenever we're doing this outside textured, uh, finish. We're treating the vehicle um, just as if we're going to paint it with smooth paint. So we want to make sure we look after all of the uh, the chipping, any type of rust, any bodywork that needs to be performed. We're not trying to hide anything, um, and that's where I think some of this texture gets a bad stigma. Is people have the impression that it's all rotted or it's hiding something. We're not hiding anything. We're performing all of the actual bodywork on it. You can see there's been quite a bit of work done on this back door, the suicide door that comes around. Um, the cladding, they've already done a lot of the sanding and prepping of the cladding. And you come along the back, you can see there's a little bit of evidence where they did some body work. And there was some uh, in behind in this area uh, where they had to use some spot putty and block sand it out. And then same thing, we come over to the driver's side. There was quite a good size ding here in the door. And then there's a couple of good sized dents here. So these are all uh, dents in parking lots. Most of this, if we didn't do it, you'd probably hide some of it, but that's not what we're about. We wanna make sure we do all the body work properly. So on the top half, you can see um, we've done the handle and we've done the mirrors. Uh, so we want more of this robust kind of look. And um, to get this finished, so everything was sanded and washed and, and prepped. But then there's a, a special coating that you spray. It's a, called an adhesion promoter. So you spray it with an adhesion promoter on all of the plastic areas you're going to be concerned with. So in this area here is a reverse style hinge for the suicide door that opens. Um, and that's a black poly. These filler panels are poly. Same thing along here. And then you've got metal. So you'll notice if you do it properly, you can't tell the difference in color between plastic, metal, metal, and plastic. So um, a lot of it has to do with the layers and the coats and how you texture it. So this is a little bit finer texture that we've laid. Um, this last chance green um, doesn't cover very well. So we had to do three coats of product as opposed to two. Um, and you wait an hour in between. So you can notice the wheels. Uh, these are an alloy wheel. Previously what we did, so they're a genuine Honda alloy wheel. Uh, previously about two years ago, uh, we sandblasted them and powder coated them, but because we're changing the color and going with the contrast, what we did is we ended up just, uh, we degreased them and cleaned them, and then we basically just scuffed them and sanded them by hand. So we sanded them and prepped them and had them ready, and then we used the same um, textured Last Chance Green uh, for that color, and then just pop the center cap on. So uh, just to give you an idea, we're not hiding anything when we're doing the bodywork on them. All of these poly sections um, will get a, a, an adhesion promoter first, a coat of that before we apply it. Um, so it's kind of a neat contrast. It's certainly going to change the look and the appearance of this, uh, of this vehicle. And this is a 2005, um, and we're in Canada, so our winters are kind of nasty. Um, but mechanically, these things go forever, and we just had a, you know, wanted to basically freshen up. There's a lot you can do. A lot of guys are nervous or worried about masking off and doing two tones and so on. Uh, but we think this is quite a nice contrast because this is all going to be the textured black on the bottom. So um, we're halfway there. So what we'll do in the next video, after we have all the black done and all the trim put back on, uh, we'll do another walk around video to see what, uh, what your opinion is of it. And then we'll obviously bolt these wheels on. So I thank you for watching. I'm John from LastChanceAutoStore.com.